聞いてもらアーティー。
so fucking what. Like, even when they were hustling for their diversity and inclusion points with Aisha Tyler. <sighs> okay, I'm not, I'm not doing this right now. Wow, oh my fucking god. Your world really is this small, isn't it? Even when Friends was at its peak, there was no such things as DEI or diversity quotas. They weren't hiring people for diversity's sake. They were hiring people to be in their show based on their accomplishments and their abilities. It was a meritocracy. Damn. <laughs> I think I'm selling it back to myself. They're saying you can only be attractive if you are a certain kind of black woman who fits into a mold that we find acceptable. The fact that you genuinely think that is really fucking sad. I don't believe at all for one nanosecond that that's what they were thinking when they created that character. <sighs> I'm not sure if I want to continue making this video. Really? Oh, fuck it. I've already done most of it. I might as well just finish it, I guess. And Aisha is gorgeous. I've always loved her. She is very brilliant and funny. But the naked anti-blackness on shows like this really gets on my nerves. Fuck, that's horseshit. Shut the fuck up. Just, just shut the fuck up. Don't make any more goddamn videos. Please. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Jesus Christ. Because it's no coincidence that they picked this episode to do that with Monica. It's a clear foil for what's happening with Charlie Wheeler. This kind of black woman with ultra straight hair and low body weight that fits a more Eurocentric beauty standard is okay. She can be attractive. She's allowed to be a human. But if it's like, you know, someone who's more urban who might wear a backwards baseball hat and have natural hair. Oh, well, no, that person's automatically masculine. For you to form that opinion and to come to those conclusions all by yourself says a lot more about you. Rough, unattractive, animalistic. Well, oh fuck, I guess Friends isn't for you. You know, there was a lot of spicy sitcoms around in the late 90s and early 2000s. Friends was not one of them, like not even fucking close. So for you to whine and complain about fucking Friends is, <laughs> it's one of the, it's genuinely one of the dumbest fucking things I've ever fucking seen. Fucking get a life. Seriously, get a fucking life. Oh yeah, and here we have just a few, a handful of the thousands of fucking retarded comments left on that particular TikToker's video. Oh yeah, this is just, it'll make you dumber by reading them, probably. <laughs> Enjoy.